guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea, and if you're new here, welcome for today's video. Okay, listen. I told myself I was not going to be spending more money on makeup for a little while because I have bought basically every single product Jaclyn Hill has come out with and I have been loving all of her stuff so much that I told myself I need a break, I'm not gonna do it, I get BoxyCharm so I get five products full sized every single month, I don't need much more than that. And then she came out with blush and you guys know I am a blush girl. I love blush, so of course I could not help myself. And I got the Bougie Rouge collection from Jaclyn Hill, and I got one of the two bundles she came out with. So I got the more warm toned um, palette collection, and this came with the Rouge Romance palette, and the bundle also came with one of these ones right here, which I'm very, very excited to try. It's like the luminous powder ones, and it also came with one of the blush sticks and then it came with two lip products so that is what we're gonna be doing we're gonna be applying several different kinds of blush and testing two of her new lip formulas and yes if you're interested about the Jaclyn Hill bougie rouge collection and if you want to see how the blushes perform and how they look on the skin then just keep on watching <laughs> So as you can see, my base is basically all done. I did apply bronzer as well, and I wanted to leave my cheeks pretty much bare after that because I wanted to test out every single different form of the blushes. So I wanted to start with the blush stick because something really interesting that she said is that these can be applied on top of powder. Now I have not set my whole entire face but the bronzer is a powder and I did set to my under eye. So I'm very curious to see how this is going to perform on top. And then after we try this one out, I think I want to try the loose powder one because I feel like that's going to look super pretty together. And then we'll take it off and try the palette out because the palette is so beautiful. Let me go ahead and show it to you guys. So like I mentioned, I did pick up the more warm toned palette and these colors are absolutely gorgeous and I feel like she really killed it with this packaging it's so much fun I love love the whole aesthetic of this collection and I absolutely love how the J's on these show you the color that you're getting I feel like that is super genius and yeah let's go ahead and get started okay so let's start out with the blush stick and this is the shade royal flush I think this is gonna be super beautiful and Let's go ahead and swatch it. Oh, ooh. Okay, I was not <laughs> expecting it to be this pigmented. Let me just blend it out. Holy, that's really, really pigmented. Okay, so it looks absolutely beautiful and it seems to be blending really, really nicely. Um, I'm still shocked at how pigmented that was. Uh, yeah so she did mention that her favorite way to apply this is with a brush and just go in lightly and apply it to the skin so that is what we're going to be doing let me zoom you guys in a little bit i'm going to be using the mirror from the palette and then just going right in this is very pigmented you guys Okay, that is super beautiful. Let's go ahead and apply it on this side. Wow, and it blends like a dream. Even though I went a little bit on top of the bronzer, I don't see anything lifting. I think this is absolutely beautiful and I'm loving the formula. Let's go ahead and dip a little more. I also feel like this is gonna last forever because you don't need much at all. Like, Look at that pigment on the brush. I'm gonna dip one more time and just apply it right on the nose. Oh my gosh, it's so pigmented, I can't take it. Again, I'm gonna blend it out with the beauty sponge, just a little more. That is absolutely beautiful. I really love how it blends out and I love that it starts super pigmented, but it's definitely easy to work with and easy to blend out. The color is absolutely stunning. I feel like I could definitely go in with another layer, but I really want to try like the blush topper, the loose powder. So let's go ahead and do that. And then we'll try out the palette and the lip products, but this is 
beautiful. Okay, I'm super excited to try this out because I do have her luminous powder and I absolutely love that powder. I didn't do like a dedicated review featuring it, but I did talk about it and I'm just gonna dip a little bit. I think I poured a little bit too much, but it's okay. It's blush season, so. Oh, <gasps> oh. <laughs> that is pigmented too. Um, I went in uh, with a little heavy hand there. Okay, so I kind of blended it out a little bit with the beauty blender afterwards. Um, it is gorgeous. I love the luminosity. You can definitely tell. Let me go with a little lighter hand on the other side. Okay, I am super impressed with both of those products so far. I'm going to be applying a little bit of highlighter just so we can finish this first part and first look. What do you guys think? I feel like my skin looks super pretty. It blended out like a dream. The topper is gorgeous. I feel like you can even use it on its own too because I, I found it very pigmented too. And so with this first round of blush, let's go ahead and try out one of the lip products that it came with. This is the shade Lip Locked and I'm not even going to be applying lip liner or anything. I just really want to try out the formula and let's go ahead and... Try it out. Oh my gosh, they smell really good. Very pigmented. It is super, super thick, if you can tell. Like, it's not liquidy at all. Okay, so far, so good. The lip is absolutely stunning. It is a very different formula. I don't think I've ever tried anything similar to it. It's very, very thick, but super lightweight once you're wearing it. I don't even feel it on my lips. Of course, it is not transfer proof. You will transfer, but she never claimed they would be transfer proof. And I feel like it's very comfortable, perfect for the summer. I love like this berry toned shade and I absolutely love the two blush products we tried. This is truly stunning and the best part is that you can wear it on top of powder, which I've never really seen anything like that before. Usually with stick products or liquid products, you can't really wear them on top of powder. So I'm very impressed with this one. I'm gonna go ahead and take this lip off and the blush so we can try the palette. Okay, so I am back. I applied bronzer again and let's try this palette out because I am very excited about all of these shades and I really love to mix and match blush shades and I don't even know where to start. Let's start light and start with Pretty Posh. These are very pigmented as well. I kind of want to try the more like reddish shades. So let's go in with Ever After. It's a very beautiful deep shade. And these shades are a little bit intimidating at first, but I like to go in with a lighter hand, kind of build it up and blend them out. And this is gorgeous. For this cheek, I'm going to go in with Boudoir. I think I'm saying that right. I'm not sure. Okay, so I went to apply some powder and just clean up that area because I went a little bit heavy-handed and crazy with the blending. I also applied highlighter and now I'm just going to quickly dust it off. Okay, so let's talk about the palette. I absolutely loved the formula from this palette. I only tried these three shades right here and I honestly cannot wait to play around with it. I feel like I don't even need any more blush product after this haul because I got everything I need basically, but I am truly impressed with this collection. Actually, out of everything I have gotten from her line, I have been impressed with everything, but this has blown my mind. I might be a little biased because I do love me some blush. If you guys have watched my channel, then you know that to be true. But um, I love, love every single formula that I tried. Also very important to note that none of these formulas emphasizes my texture and I love how my skin is looking. Let's apply the last product, which is the other lipstick. And this one is in the shade Sincerely Yours.
okay and this is the final look this is the shade sincerely yours I also do like the packaging of her new lip products they feel nice and heavy and I feel like the color matched with this one which is lip locked more than with sincerely yours I don't feel like the color is an absolute match to it um, but I kind of like the color on better than I like it on the packaging because I really thought this was gonna be a little too bright for my liking but I absolutely love both of these colors again the formula is very different very very thick at first but once it's on you cannot even feel that it's there and overall I am super impressed with this collection I absolutely loved every single thing that I tried on um, no regrets here I am so happy I picked this up this has been my favorite collection of them all and I am super super happy with all of these products so that is it for today's video if you guys did enjoy it please go ahead and give it a thumbs up make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't hit that little bell so you never miss any of my videos and as always I will see you guys in my next video bye everything else was I don't know what I'm saying I did apply blondes <laughs> Blonzer. <laughs> the long nail struggle. Tweezers.